WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, and we've got a mixed bag. Not unusual. The mix goes like this. The Dow's off 63. The S&P is flat. NASDAQ's up 51. Russell's up 18. That's 1% move. Semi's up nearly 2% or 82 points. We've got gold off five bucks. Silver's up 17 pennies. Lights recruit up a buck 43. You got natural gas off four cents. So do your treasuries down one point and two ticks. And you got the U.S. dollar index trading up uh, uh, out at 104.20. That's up about 288 ticks out there. Let's take a look at what all this means by looking at that nine panel market update chart we begin the upper left hand corner the es mini well we've made a new all-time high did we make one today let's see yesterday was 50 20 today we're at 50 16. no no new all-time high today just yet but price above all resistance no profile levels above the green oscillator change line uh it should continue to move higher no topping pattern uh, there is a roads momentum indicator signal so if we did get a bearish reversal candle that would confirm a top spot volatilics is in a position that assists the buyers with it being below its 50-day exponential moving average 50-day currently printed at 1356 right now you've got the spot fix at 1294 natural gas uh, natural gas the nq yesterday negated its roads momentum indicator top or trade above yesterday's high it's in full out bullish breakout mode should continue to move higher u.s dollar index is likely to find resistance is trading into both the top of its bear structure daily profile trading just above that but right into its descending trend line resistance i would expect we would see the u.s dollar index pull back and test support around the 102.90 level that's what i would expect but we've got to go take the currency pairs and see what they're doing if you take a look at both gold silver and the dollar you see basically the same pattern price trading within rising and descending trend lines also near their profile levels not really a whole lot to add there but we will take a look at uh, silver during the trader's ed show we're going to take a look at light sweet crude light sweet crude should go target the 7826 level uh, or 78 7862 or 7826 level that's the target why well because it's trading above the center of its bullish structure daily profile and that's what simply price should go do in the case of natural gas it's ugly it's fugly but you and i we're waiting for the week uh, the month the weekly we're waiting for the weekly bullish reversal candle certainly isn't this week or at least not as of 1102 uh, today uh, but that we know what to wait for because seasonally speaking we should see some kind of bottom form in natural gas so the 30-year treasury is testing support at 119.23 it closed below that we hit 119 even Steve. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show, but if you have to start your Thursday, please have a terrific one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care now.